friends today in this video we will understand more about the process of counting in groups with a few interesting examples hey look honey there are so many mice here yes there are many come on let us count them honey look carefully they can all be seen in groups yes there are three groups of mice here just look carefully all the groups don't have the same number of mice oh yes there are five mice in this first group four in the second group and five in the third group that means there are two groups with five mice each and one group with four mice here so how many mice would be there in total for that we will add the number of mice in all three groups but honey if we find out the total number of mice in the two groups of five each it would be 10 in which if we add the remaining 4 that is if we add 4 to 10 the total number of mice here will be 14 well done bunny you found out the number of mice with an easy method come on now let us look at another example bunny can you tell me that How many pairs of walkie-talkies are over here? A pair means a group of two similar things, isn't it? Yes, that is right, Bunny. Come on, let us count together. Here, in the first line, there are four pairs. In the second line, also four. That is, there are eight pairs in total. If we add four pairs from the third line, then how many pairs will be there in total? If we add the four pairs of the third line, there will be twelve pairs. And adding four from the fourth line, sixteen. So there are sixteen pairs of walkie-talkies here. Yes, Bunny. Now tell us that if there are sixteen pairs of walkie-talkies. Then how many walkie talkies are there in all? There are sixteen pairs of walkie talkies. Every pair has two walkie talkies. That means there is a total of thirty-two walkie talkies. Well done, Bunny. Children, I hope that you must have well understood the process of counting. in groups in the next video we will watch some interesting examples related to this 